Welcome back guys to another video and in this part we are going to defeat Jorogumo the spider type boss in Neo and let's see how it goes okay so basically to defeat this boss you have to get behind it and hit its weakness its weak spot that is the glowing part the glowing orange part that these spiders have on on their back like that like like that one and yeah that's about it uh, but don't forget to carry a lot of explosives and a lot of fire talismans or water tal talismans whatever you have and uh, I'm using these weapons but uh, and, and a sword but I decided to use uh, Odachi for this one because I'm comfortable with Odachi um, in this boss fight so um, I guess I guess this will do this is enough for uh, this boss so I'll equip the Odachi and put some enchantments on it like the fire one yes let's do this so let's go what you have to do is just try to get behind it like I am doing okay I will try to get behind it so just keep that in mind be careful not to get hit because I got hit <laughs> several times it will damage you I am at a higher level so uh, I don't think it will damage me that much but if you get hit you will die hit from the behind that glowing part, that that is weakness, it will become to a weaker form if you hit it properly, but I didn't, so try to hit it properly. Now, uh, like this, as you can see, I hit it and it gets into this form. It, it's a weaker form, so just have to hit it and avoid its attacks. And the attacks are very simple, just have to avoid them, but I couldn't. Because I was, uh, I was out of uh, practice at that time. I'm playing this part after a long time, so avoid the yellow, uh, sorry, the purple part, because that uh, that will slow you, and that will also uh, cause some damage. So avoid it. Okay. I wasn't able to avoid a lot of attacks, so you have to be careful. Not make uh, mistakes like me. You will get one uh, one hit. As you see, now it's out of breath. You can attack it continuously, but I wasn't able to do that. You can do that. Now it has recovered its uh, stamina. It will start to jump on you like it did on me. And that will also want to kill you. Want to kill you. But I am at a higher level so I didn't die. I will get it by this at that time. Uh, I was in it again. So it's the second time I was hit. It's the third time I was hit. Uh, I was barely avoid, uh, uh, able to avoid the death. Just get behind it and try to hit the yellow part if you can. But I would re uh, recommend you use um, the lower stance um, after uh, in second phase after you have dropped uh, it has uh, more than half. It will also uh, not succumb to that form if you have dealt enough damage and lower lower it has below half. It's so much better. Use some explosive. Explosive helps a lot. And that's all there is to it. I will use this tangy fan. And yeah, it's gone, it's dead. So that's it, that's, uh, that's how you do it guys, that's how you beat Jorogumo. Just have to carry a lot of, um, uh, you know, those explosives and fire talismans. You can use the Odachi or Dual Swords, those are best in these situations. You can also use, uh, what we call that, um, Kurosigama. Yeah, so I'll see you guys in the next video. Till then, thank you guys for watching.